Attack in Paris leaves three people dead and several more wounded. Three individuals were killed and three others were injured when a shooter opened fire in the heart of Paris. The shooter opened fire on residents in the neighborhood as he was aiming for a Kurdish cultural center. Investigating potential racial motivations. A 69-year-old suspect was detained right away, and it immediately became clear that he had just been released from jail. Police and a group that had assembled at the spot following the incident got into a fight afterwards. Tear gas was used by riot police in response to footage showing individuals setting fires in the middle of the street and shattering vehicle windows. Unrest erupted when a tall, white, elderly man in the 10th arrondissement of Paris shot and killed two men and a lady on Rue d'Enguien. One of the three wounded individuals was reportedly in critical condition, while the other two were being treated for grave injuries. Although the shooting's cause has not been established, Paris prosecutor Laure Bacu stated the man has previously been accused of engaging in racial violence. He used a sword to strike tents at a Parisian migrant camp in that event, which happened on December 8 in Bercy. He had only lately been freed, although it was unclear why. There is presently no information linking the suspect to ultra-right organizations, according to French Interior Minister Gerald Darmanin, who previously traveled to the site.